watchmen see the sword come and blow not the trumpets, and the people be not warned, if the sword come and take any person from among them, he is taken away in his iniquity. But his blood will I require at the watchman's hand. So thou, O Eagles of Philadelphia. Well, I'm surprised to see you guys here. I thought it was all over. But even though the king is never wrong, it looks like I was wrong, which I never am. The injury gods threw mud at you. But the perseverance gods wiped you off and patted your behind. Now all you need is Lady Luck and Lord Victory to smile upon thee, and the championship will be thine. So for you, I'll say it only once. Philly, Philly! So you're probably thinking, well, these teams play in the Super Bowl all the time. But what I found significant about this is the timing that this is happening in now. The Eagles represent America, it also represents the Faithful Church. And if you look up what the New England Patriots um, country symbol, it's not a bird, but it's a tree. And the tree flag is an appeal to heaven flag. So yeah, I found that pretty interesting. Then, you know, they show a dragon. The war against the dragon. Which is also very significant in this time. And the hidden symbolism everywhere. That is a great question. I gotta go. Long story short, you're probably fine. Sorry, man. No worries, we're not late. Let's go. Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold, 
I will make them to come and worship before thy feet and to know that I have loved thee. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. Behold, I come quickly. Hold that fast which thou hast, that no man take thy crown. Him that overcometh will I make a pillar in the temple of my God, and he shall go no more out. And I will write upon him the name of my God, and the name of the city of my God, which is New Jerusalem, which cometh down out of heaven from my God. And I will write upon him my new name. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches.